Well, the number of traffic fatalities on our streets continues to rise. The latest numbers from TPD says it puts us right now at 77. With the increase in these numbers, though, you can expect to see more officers rolling out on motorcycles once they're done with training. News 4 Tucson's Upita Murillo has more. This is the first day of a four and a half week training on motors. There are 13 officers out there. Eight of those are from the Tucson Police Department. The more motor officers we can have out there, the safer we can make the streets. Also among the 13 officers in training, University of Arizona Police, Pima County Sheriff's Department, and Miranda Police is providing an instructor. Tucson Police Officer Ruben Herrera has been a motor officer for over six years. He's also an instructor. For us to be out there to be able to enforce laws, educate people, and make sure everyone's driving safely is paramount. Motors is a special assignment, and officers have to be on the department three years before putting on a helmet. Richard Valentine is revved up about the opportunity. He put in his request as soon as he could. It's a passion of mine. Ever since I graduated the academy, traffic enforcement is important. He also believes. A lot of times people don't realize they're going fast as they are, and not only with you know traffic control, issuing tickets, um, traffic enforcement, with showing visible presence, not only with being a motor officer and also pulling traffic, um, it lets the community know that we're out there and we're taking this seriously. Valentine adds. I want to get out there on a bike, make a difference, and keep Tucson safe. By the time their training is over, they'll have put in 180 hours and they'll have ridden over 3,000 miles on police motorcycles. All this in an effort to keep the community safe. Reporting from the southeast side, Lupita Murillo, News for Tucson.